This idea for this show came to me in a hotel room in San Francisco at about 2 o'clock in the morning, skimming through the channel. There's actually a um, documentary about the topographical mapping of the desert, and I started thinking, that's really interesting because they can't really topographically map the desert because it's constantly changing. And I started thinking about contemporary art and how it's constantly changing, and also how so many artists deal with nature or natural elements in their work. And this exhibition uh, really affords a great opportunity to explore a lot of recent acquisitions our collection that we haven't been able to put on view until recently. This is a really uh, great installation by um a young artist named Tara Donovan is called Untitled Mylar. Uh, this piece was debuted with this exhibition. Uh, and what I love about Tara Donovan's work is that Tara Donovan takes the most banal of materials. This piece being just basic mylar, um, but she's used everything from toothpicks to paper plates to styrofoam cups to really push these everyday items and become to become these incredible sculptural objects. Um, this piece, what I love about it is that it looks like jewels, it looks like something you might find on the ocean floor, it looks like mold spores. So I love the idea of how it plays with light. It has this incredible push of the surface being the topographical surface of anything that the viewer is wishing to interpret. This exhibition was actually originally conceived to complement an uh, exhibition that's currently up, Ingrid Kalam, uh, our first artist residency, and Ingrid Kalam actually traces on the ground. And I started thinking about this idea of her work being like a topographical map. Jorge Pardo was born in Cuba and he came to the States very young, so you'll find a lot of his work that has architectural as well as decorative elements, such as this piece called Untitled Set of Seven Lamps. And looking at it, it's really spectacular, it really envelops the space, but also you can see the uh, reflections on the wall. And they have a very organic quality, almost bug-like.